Hi, this is Mark Goring with the CDS Consulting Co-op. At the Strategic Co-op Seminars, we have three main goals. Advancing our thinking, building shared understanding, and creating alignment at our co-ops and among co-ops. The theme for 2013 is growing our co-ops, and we use a couple of powerful questions during the day to focus the conversation. The first question is, why does growth matter and what does it look like when we're successful? The second question is, how as leaders can we get our communities engaged, aligned, and participating in growing our co-ops? After more than an hour of small group conversation, we ask each small group to distill the conversations they've been having down to just a few words. Then a person from each group shares their work. Here's a sampling. Enjoy. Building a cohesiveness yet nimble to each unique community. Growth with purpose, the idea of uh, incorporating that triple bottom line. The creation of uh, co-op economic, social, and environmental power, not creating a seat for ourselves at the table, but creating a new table that others want to join. The increased growth of co-ops and the political impact that co-ops can have uh, and to organize around that. The changing paradigm of the economic system and business models and to show that and how that's done. Principle six is a valuable to the existing startup and uh, startups and co-ops. Um, so our three ideas were understanding the importance of the triple bottom line, uh, utilizing community engagement to solve problems, and creating a global sense of sustainability. Growing societal benefits, growth of shared resources, and building economic diversity. Getting new co-ops off the ground. A shift of allegiance and support through knowledge and ownership. Ownership was a word that kept coming up. Networking for stronger local slash regional food systems. Growth as a necessity to staying relevant. How to increase accessibility of nutritious food and how to engage and educate the community in a way that's inviting and welcoming versus threatening. Grow to do good and to serve our community better. Also to communicate the story to stay relevant. Cooperation leads to higher consciousness. Success means inclusive participation. And cooperation among co-ops is growth. One, growth is more than dollars. Financial strength empowers global change. And cooperation inspires innovation. Innovation inspires participation. Growth matters because everything else keeps changing. Success uh, looks like um, recognizing multiple dimensions of growth and it also looks like more and more diverse participation. Growth through building relationships, interdependence through collaboration, triple bottom line, community impact, financial impact, environmental impact. Uh, grow to maximize your positive impact on the local community. Um, success is a strong sense of community. And a question that we just couldn't get over by all these questions was how do you measure community involvement? Uh, we said becoming cooperative ambassadors. Uh, growth matters um, in having an impact not just on the community but on society and on the world. We went big. We said we would be successful if the co-op was relevant to the community needs. Getting non-financial support from local leaders, for example a community advisory board. Telling a story of why co-ops are valuable to a community. Building community through informal events. One is real conversations that avoid co-op jargon when we're talking to the community. Nice. Share information or best practices on member engagement. And number th uh, three, build trust with communication and openness. Ask rather than tell. Link community concerns. Celebrate co-op achievements. Listen for co-op and community needs. Create opportunities and manage systems. Telling the inspiring hero story of the co-op. 
with a cooperatively owned newspaper. <laughs> Invite in community leaders and listen to them. Meet and align with similar community groups. Reimagine your definitions and understanding. Listen and learn. Accept that you don't know everything. Tell the stories. Engage your communities in their human stories instead of just focusing on the business end of the cooperative. Talk to people. <laughs> Nurture relationships and leadership. Yes. And provide immediate engagement for new members. Uh, so we want leaders to create systems that empower members to contribute. We want to encourage and celebrate all kinds of participation. Assume positive intent from engaged members for engagement, to offer levels of engagement that meet people where they are, um, for alignment, to identify and prioritize issues outside of the co-op that promote the ends of the co-op um, and give feedback on people's impact, and for participation, um, develop staff and board diversity that reflects the community to promote participation. Adapt your technology to connect. Coordinate with like-minded orgs and co-ops. And use a collective and shared timeline for all of us. Do network with other community leaders. Highlight successes. And that we need to start talking about racism and classism within our organizations. Thinking engagement, alignment, participation as a three-step strategy. Asking a diverse group and listening to them empowering members to recruit. And so we had um, build alliances with existing organizations with shared values, and be sensitive to people's cultural perspectives, and understand your own assumptions, collect the stories from your members, my words, and share them. Thanks so much. Thank you, right. Thank you to all of you. We have got some great ideas. and. I really love to see how much crossover there was. There's a lot of convergence happening just across this whole room. It's really pretty powerful.